Hi, I'm Heidi, and I'm here with David Burns, author of AutoCAD for Dummies. David, how long have you been using AutoCAD? I've been using AutoCAD since about 1984. Oh, okay, what version did you start? One, one point four. Oh my goodness! Yes, okay, yes. got me beat. Yeah. <laughs> so, as a as a longtime user of AutoCAD, I'm not going to say old, veteran, Thank you. Thank veteran you. user of AutoCAD. Um, I'm guessing you probably like to type your commands as opposed to the user interface. Yes, that's uh, that's true um, for a few reasons. Partly because I'm I'm used to it. Um, I think it's also the fastest way of working with the program. It's the only method really that's been consistent um, all the way through. The user interface has changed a few times, three or four or five times, uh, but the keyboarding method still stays the same. Now, when you say it's it's faster, are you typing the entire command? No. Oh, okay. What we have in AutoCAD. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> there are some long commands in there too. Uh, what we have in AutoCAD are aliases, which are, as you know, are the uh, two or three letter abbreviations for commands. Um, they're saved in a file called the ACAD PGP, which is very easily modified. And um, what I've found over the years is I'm creating my own additions to that. Okay. Now, what are some examples? Can you describe, like... Well, for example, the way that AutoCAD comes out of the box, uh, the letter C is the alias for the circle command. I think in drafting, in everyday drafting, people use copy way more than they draw circles. So one thing I'll do very early on is redefine that alias uh, C to copy, okay. and then make a new one for circle, which I use, like CI or something like that. I was like just going to ask, yes. what do you use? Okay, oh, that's a great tip. Great, well, thank you.